Oh, she's doing it, she's doing it. Do you like your new house? Remy and welcome back to my channel. So in case you haven't been keeping up with my vlogs then you would not know that I bought a house! I just got the keys yesterday and of course before moving in the movers are literally getting here in like an hour or so so we got here extra early to film this for you. It's super echoey right now because there's no furniture in here yet but I am so, so excited to start this new journey with all of you guys and to document the whole process. Be sure to check out my vlog channel if you guys want to see moving vlogs. I'm going to do a ton over there. We've already begun all the packing and everything, obviously. Also on this channel, I'm going to have a bunch of moving videos and decoration things and things like that for you guys, so be sure to subscribe. And yeah, today I wanted to do an empty house tour for you guys to show you and also just to keep for my memory's sake. I think that's about it. Give this video a big thumbs up if you like it and let's get started. Okay, so we're starting at the front door. Right now we have all the lights on. Don't worry, we're gonna turn them all off after, but it is a gloomy day outside. Daisy's following him up there. Please look at that. She loves it here, you guys. <laughs> Did she come show her? Oh, there yeah, she is. She looks. Okay, all right, so come this way. Over here we have, I think this is like the family room. I have so many plans for everything. There is a fireplace here where you turn it on with this light switch. It takes a little bit, but we'll come back to it once it's on. It is so Flippin' pretty. Over here, I'm gonna put some artwork up and then I have plans to put two couches and like a coffee table in here. Also, there are outlets literally everywhere in this house. I'm most excited. Also, this is the reason why I wanted this house. This black, I love the black accents in this house. I've never seen anything like it. I think it's just so dynamic and I love the look of this black ceiling. So, I'm excited to have a lot of different black furniture and things which I've never had before. So yeah, that's this room. Also, the vents in this house are really cool. It's so echoey in here, it's crazy. I like the vents throughout all the house. It looks bougie. Moving on over here, we have... <laughs> What? The way Cal just went down the Did staircase. Did you see him? Yeah. Obviously my boyfriend Cal is here also. He's trying to keep track of Daisy. She's having a field day, you guys. I was so worried because a lot of people told me that when they bring their dogs to new places, they get scared and they're uncomfortable. Daisy has been having a field day running through every room everywhere. Okay. Moving here, we have the dining room, which I'm keeping my same dining room table. I need to get some new chairs, but it's white marble with silver, so it matches perfectly with this whole house. Also, the backyard grass area is over here on the side, if you can see that. <gasps> Daisy May, come here, we were just talking about you. Come here. Oh. So anyway, this way. <laughs> oh my god, here we have this wine rack area, which I will be keeping only Tito's in. And also, we found out yesterday that I can fit in here. <laughs> so yes, I'm gonna keep Tito's and wine in here. It's so cute. This is another reason why I love this house. Then we have here, the family, oh what is this? The living room. Here it is, I'm obsessed with this. Again, we have the dynamic ceiling with the black all around. We have this chandelier fixture here, which I am definitely going to be switching out with the one that I have at home. This one's really cool too, but I have one at home that I love so much, so I'm gonna put that one here. My plans thus far are to put the couch here, a big coffee table, and then a big media center there with a giant TV. That's what I'm hoping to do. Moving on, this part. <laughs> I can jump on here now because this is my own house. Thumbnail, house. As we all know, I love a good cooking with Remy episode and I'm so excited to have this massive kitchen. Why are we laughing? Cal's making faces in oh the background. Oh my God, it's so annoying. This kitchen is my absolute dream kitchen. I have a massive marble countertop. I've got so much storage you don't even know. I have so many things, you guys. My aunt got me a dehydrator for Christmas and it's like this big. I never had space for it so I just gave it to my parents for the time being. Now I'll be taking it back and you won't believe how many times I've thought about random things I'm going to now dehydrate. I'm so excited. So I'll be bringing that here along with all of my air fryers and everything like like that. Bar stools are gonna go here. We've got these really cool gold lamps that kind of remind me of like the little Pixar lamp. Up there, we've got a little sink right there. Another big sink over here. Oh, you gotta see this. This is Eli's favorite part. No. Oh. No, the best, the, the best feature. What is that? These are outlets that are <laughs> childproof for my baby that I don't have. <laughs> for Daisy. Honestly, for me, most likely. <laughs> okay, here we have the coolest thing ever. <laughs> Everything in this house is the coolest thing ever. The fridge 
is black on the inside. Isn't that nuts? All we have here so far is just water and Chick-fil-A sauce. But it's super cool. I am so stoked to have a massive fridge. My one at my apartment is so small right now. And it's been great for the past few years, but finally I have my big own fridge so I can do all the cooking in the world. Over here also, this is really cool. The microwave opens up like this. She's rich. That's amazing. If I put that on TikTok, I'm pretty sure it'll go viral. So look out. Moving on, we have a giant, giant stove with two ovens. This is like a warming rack, which you can keep it hot and just keep your food warm all day, which is nuts. And over here, another reason, you guys are not kidding. I obviously saw the house. I was in love with it. I loved everything about it, but this was what sealed the deal. After I saw this, I was like, I'm putting an offer in. My own walk-in pantry. I am so excited. Also, all of the like security cameras and like Wi-Fi and everything is all concealed up there, so it's nice in a way and just stays in there. Also, there's so much like cabinetry over here. This is like what the office was before, but now in my own kitchen. Oh, there's a pack of beers in here. I love that. A <laughs> housewarming gift. To oh, and the fire's on. <laughs> here she is. Doesn't that look cool? Yeah, okay, let me turn it off before I burn down my new house. That'd be really sad. Over here now, we have the garage and this door, which we're going to be transforming into something really cool, so wait for that. Then we have our first bathroom in here. That's just like a good little guest bathroom. And then over here is going to be the guest bedroom, which my mom is very excited about. In here, there's just gonna be a guest bed, some nightstand, a little dresser, and a TV for whoever wants to stay over. Maybe we have a party and some people aren't able to drive home, they can sleep here. Also, every single bedroom has a bathroom here, you guys, and every bathroom also has a shower, but not just a normal shower, a rain shower. Do you see that? Look at that. Isn't that insane? So that's the first bedroom downstairs. Also, there's a little closet in here. All right, well you can't see, but it's a Harry Potter closet. I'm too scared to lock myself in, never mind. <laughs> Also, I've always wanted a house with a nest thing. This is like a thermostat. I just think they're so cute and cool and sleek and techy and I've always wanted one and this one came with a bunch of them, so yes. All right, so that was the full downstairs. Now let's go up the stairs, which I have always wanted a house that is two stories. I've always wanted an apartment with two stories. I just like stairs in general. So follow me up this way. I know I'm gonna regret the stairs when I'm walking up and down them, but when I was shopping for a house, I liked the idea. I'm out of breath from the stairs. There's also two giant skylights over there and this giant light fixture, which is so fun. Oh my God, I'm out of breath. I'm so out of shape, okay. In here, we have the master bedroom, which is going to be so cute. I have this cool chandelier. I'm gonna put a giant bed in here. There you are. Same thing, bed studio here, nightstand, maybe some other little dresser stuff, some cute things, big TV. And then this I don't know how to turn on. I think it's through an app, but it's a giant like fireplace thing. Moving over here behind this door, we have this right here, which is pretty much the coolest closet ever. Welcome to the walk-in closet. It is seriously so massive. To everyone wondering, I still am keeping my glam room, but obviously this closet is seriously so cool. I just love my glam room for all my girl nights and getting ready with my friends and things. But this closet is Incredible, I love the color of wood that they chose and I wanna definitely add in some like black accents. I have some black ottomans and things that will look so cute in here with like black flowers, etc. All right, moving over to the bathroom. We have the bathroom here. This is the master bath. Look at this shower, you guys, it's insane. There's a rain shower, there's two other showers. I don't know what they're called. There's just a lot of showers going on in one shower. Then we have a huge bathtub here, which is seriously so nice. I can't wait to break this in. And then the kitchen, not kitchen. <laughs> and then we have the bathroom sinks right over there, which I love everything so, so much. They actually just added this mirror in recently. And I think it's really cool because I like how it ties into black and adds a little bit of like a wood accent all into the bathroom. And I love the marble too, it's so big. I seriously thought after my last apartment I'd never find a shower as big as that and I think I found bigger, so. Yay! Turn on the water! Okay! <laughs> Straight off of the master, we have this room here, which is going to be an office. It is so cute. Again, there's another bathroom with another shower. 
and I love all the natural lighting in this room. We've got two big windows, actually three big windows, and then every room has its own closet for more storage. I'm thinking like a desk here, and then some shelves and things there, which will be really cool. This is the smallest room, but I like all the light. I think it's really, really nice in here. We got another nest thing there, and then over here, what does this light do? Whoa, oh, cool. I'm still learning. <laughs> okay. Here we have the room which my glam room is going to be in. Where you guys are is where all of that closet stuff is gonna go. My island's gonna be here and then my vanity is going to be over there. Also there is a massive deck out there that I wanna put a big like lounge bed on that we can all chill on. Alicia said that she's so excited to come over because I have so many balconies and she can just come over and drink her coffee and hang out with me. Wash and dryer is gonna go in there. I still have to go buy that, so that laundry room will be done eventually. Look out for a vlog, I'll show you guys. And then the last room up here is this one here, which I'm going to make into a filming room. So in here, we're gonna do like the drop down backgrounds, everything like that, and we'll just be filming a bunch of like fun videos for you guys. Over here, I'm gonna keep a little like coffee bar cart to keep us caffeinated to film. I can put a TV up there, and it's just gonna be super cute. I also just noticed that my neighbors have a soccer ball, have fun. <laughs> But the coolest part of this room is, that, that, actually two things, this is a sensor light, which I thought was really cool, and this bathroom sink is cool too. In here we have the shower again, and then the sink is so beautiful, I love the white, the black, and then when I open it, look at it, how cool this drawer is. It goes like around the pole, so you can fit so much stuff in here. And they close gently. Amazing. Last but not least, we have the backyard, which this is the coolest part, I think. If you go like this, and then go like this, and then push this, <laughs> you push this all the way open, then you have these beautiful doors that just slide to the pool! Look at the pool! It is currently raining in LA, so the pool is not the cutest, but this is a waterfall, and it's the most therapeutic thing ever when it's just running and it's so pretty. I love the deck, it's all like redwood. Can, Can you turn it on? Yeah. Oh, he knows how to turn it on. That's why we mm. keep him around, ladies. Ooh, isn't that cool? <laughs> For real though, isn't that therapeutic? When I first toured the house, they had these doors open with that running and I was like, Okay. All right, so I'm gonna put deck furniture here, this way. It's raining and I don't wanna go in the rain, but there's gonna be a dining table here for all the fun summer parties we'll throw. And then there is a grill with a fridge over there so you can keep your like beers in there. I don't know what people do. And then Daisy's grass area is all across the side of the house and she's been loving it. Do we know where she is? She looks so tiny. Hi, Daisy Nate. Hi, Bobby. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed my empty house tour. Thank you so much for watching. Again, be sure to check out the vlog channel and the main channel for all the moving videos, and we'll see you next time. Bye!